2021 Volkswagen Jetta GLI review, uppercut from the underdog. Ever wondered what a Golf GDI in sedan form could accomplish? The Volkswagen Jetta GLI is that fantasy come to life. The GLI has always trailed behind the flagship Golf GDI models as a consolation prize for those who wanted a hot hatchback but didn't have the budget for it, but in many ways, this isn't a bad thing. Think of it as that song you always skip but one day you listen to it and realize it's actually damn good. It's VW's answer to the Kia Forte GT and the Honda Civic Si, but is that answer good enough? Well, the unsuspecting Volkswagen borrows its 228 horsepower 2.0 liter turbo from the GDI and also offers a manual option, making it viable to keep the GLI on your shopping list. Could this be the next big thing in the USA for performance enthusiasts? Maybe. It has an admirable amount of tech and comfort to offer and it's rather practical for an entry-level performance car, so at the outset, the GLI looks like a winner. Jetta GLI Exterior The GLI's exterior styling is slightly lukewarm in comparison to its esteemed hatch sibling, the GDI. That being said, it's certainly not boring. The GLI's front end is home to a set of geometric C-shaped LED headlights that sit on either side of the trademark honeycomb grille. The thin red stripe across the snout denotes its performance focus along with the red GLI badging. Sharp tail lights sit under a subtle spoiler and a set of two exhaust openings poke out from either side of the conservative diffuser. Both trim levels get 18-inch wheels as standard, but only the Autobahn gets a panoramic sunroof. Dimensions The Jetta GLI's dimensions make it bigger than both the Civic Si and the Kia Forte GT. Its length is where its larger size stands out the most with a measurement of 185.2 inches stretched over a 105.6 inch wheelbase. It has a width of 70.8 inches and stands 57.9 inches tall. It sits relatively low to the ground and has a 5.5 inch ground clearance. The curb weight for the entry-level trim is 3,228 pounds, which is heavier than the Civic Si, while the DSG pushes this weight up to 3,294 pounds. Exterior Colors The Jetta GLI is available in your choice of five colors. No-cost options include deep black pearl and pyrite silver metallic from the metallic palette and pure white and tornado red from the solid swatches. Only Pure Grey asks a $295 premium. On the Autobahn, Pure Grey, Pure White, and Tornado Red can all be paired with black detailing, but this required the $595 black package for a black roof and other elements. 2021 Jetta GLI Performance Not many people associate thrilling performance with a Jetta in their minds, but the GLI is here to change that. It's not a track fiend by any means, but the GLI is a determined little sedan that'll bring some excitement to your daily commute. We think of these cars as the perfect starting point for young performance enthusiasts, but they'll be just as rewarding for more experienced drivers. Those who opt for the 2.0-liter turbo to be mated to the 6-speed manual transmission can expect a run from 0 to 60 miles per hour in under 6 seconds, more than half a second quicker than the Civic Si. Opting for the snappier 7-speed DSG cuts the run to 60 miles per hour down by a few tenths. Both models have a top speed that's limited to 126 miles per hour. While the Jetta's ability to briskly accelerate from point A to point B is impressive, Volkswagen has ensured that the GLI will remain composed in and out of the corners. This is thanks to the limited slip differential in the front that controls outputs to each wheel, managing traction expertly. Engine and Transmission An undeniable bragging point that the GLI has is its engine. The top-tier Jetta borrows its motor from the Golf GDI, giving it a distinct advantage over its competitors. The cult classic 2.0-liter turbo has been a favorite among gearheads for many years, so it's a welcome power plant for the GLI. The turbocharged 2.0-liter four-banger pushes out 228 horsepower and 258 lb-ft of torque. These are impressive power outputs in general for a vehicle at this price point, but it stands out even more when you put it next to its rivals from Honda and Kia. 
The Civic SI manages 205 HP and 192 LBFT and is solely available in manual guise. The Forte GT's 1.6 liter turbo produces 201 HP and 197 LBFT. You'll get the choice between a 6 speed manual transmission or the esteemed 7 speed DSG. The former will undoubtedly appeal to purists, but it's not as snappy as we would have liked it to be. The DSG is far more eager to flit through gears, but it seems slightly sedate in comparison to the setup on the Golf GDI.